Hi there, it's Mick here from Infinity Innovations and in this video I'm going to quickly show you how to set an AC charge using the Hanshu ESS app. So the first thing we need you to do is open your app and it should log you into your station. If you're not already logged in just use the username and password you were given by your installer to log in and then once you log in you'll be presented with this page. So right at the bottom we have the menu section down there and the second one across is device. I'd like you to click this. And then on the device page you are then presented with all the devices that are tethered to your account. Um, for this video I need you to make sure that the inverter is highlighted and then anywhere on the picture below just simply click there to access the real time data. So you will be presented with a power diagram that's showing you the flow of energy moving around your property from PV, grid, load and battery. Underneath there you have remote control. I'll click that. These options will appear and then the second one down is energy setup. Click that. And then the top menu is work mode. It will say self consumption mode. What I'd like you to do is click self consumption mode wording. This will pop up at the bottom and then just scroll it down to user defined and press confirm. Once this has been done, this is where all the charge time periods will appear. And this is now where you can set your charge periods uh, to charge the batteries from the grid. So for the purpose of this video, I am gonna use the Octopus Go uh, time settings which we know is um, half past midnight till 5.30 in the morning that's where you get some nice cheap energy and you want to power your batteries from that cheap energy through that period so what we do is we want to set a start time and an end time so on charge time period one click the first box and to set midnight we obviously need to go to zero zero so the left column is your hours the right column is your minutes so we select the minutes that we want. So as you can see, once that saves, we now have 0030, that's half past midnight. And to the right of that, the next block is our finish time. So click this, and we are gonna set that for 5.30. And press confirm. Successfully set, so that means that both times are now successfully set, which means that every night between those pe that period there, the batteries will charge from the grid. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to show you what that looks like charging from the grid. So what I'm going to do is in the charge time period two, is I'm just going to set a charge period for an hour. We're at 11 six, uh, 11.36 now, so that's my start time. And then my end time, I'm just going to add an extra of hours on there and that's set successfully so in the top left hand corner just under in my uh, case here under the time I'm going to press the back arrow and then press that again to bring me back to the power diagram and as you can see now we are now pulling power in from the grid because I've just set this inverter to charge immediately for the next few hours so we are now pulling power in from the grid which is feeding the load and also feeding the batteries. They also have a little bit of PV. It's very poor here at the minute as a weather, so not much going on there, but I do have a small amount of PV with the grid power powering my batteries. And it's as simple as that. That's how you set an AC charge using the Hanshu ESS app.